Now, what is it you got? Well, not out there, everybody. This is Jordan Jones. You want a letter from me, Toad? I'm welcoming you back to the Republic of Jordan and my playthrough of Super Mario Galaxy 2 for the Nintendo Wii. If you're interested in this playthrough, why don't you snap that like button for me? I'd really appreciate that. Let's see how many likes we can get this video up to. Um, and let me know down in the comments below for question of the video. Um, um, what's your favorite 3D Mario game and why? I would love to know. I would love to know what your favorite 3D Mario platformer is and why. What we're going to do now is we're going to go back to World 5, the world we're supposed to be in, and we're going to do the galaxy we have not done yet, which is this one right here. Slip Sane Galaxy. My favorite two 3D Mario games have to be the Galaxy games. It have to be this and Galaxy 1. These are my two favorites. The Galaxy games are my two favorite 3D Mario games because they're just, they have a lot of imagination in them and, they're, and I love how you're in space since there's no limits with gravity, there's no limits of level designs, they just go wild. Squidward's Sandy Sinkhole, this star right here, this mission really isn't even that difficult. It's just kind of annoying to play just because of the boss. It's just the boss that's annoying about it. The, level, the boss really isn't even that difficult, it's just... I don't really have to practice these missions before I do them because I know these missions aren't really that difficult, so. So I don't have to worry about that. Because these missions aren't really that difficult, so. So what we need to do, we need to dodge these fireballs. And wow, that was easy. And, okay, I'm going to be careful here. I'm going to concentrate because this part's kind of tedious. I mean, this is, let me say, one of my least, this is one of my least favorite galaxies in the game. It's okay. It's an okay galaxy. This galaxy's okay, but I don't dislike it by any means, but I'm just not fond of this galaxy as much. I mean, it looks cool. It looks really cool. It's still fun to play nonetheless, but it's just one of my least favorites in the game. It's just not one I'll play all the time. I mean, it's not a difficult galaxy by any means, but... Okay, the Comet Medal's here, just in case you did not know. It's not that hard, you just, that's how you really get the Comet Medal. It's not that hard to get, you just have to do that. It's not that difficult. Ah, we got rid of those chickens that were pooping bombs. Cause we don't need those chickens, because they're annoying. I love the Fire Flower in Galaxy so much. I really like the music of the Fire Flower. If you, if you like two of these torches, you'll get a one-up, keep in mind. But I'm not going to do it, because I'm just going to do it the safe way. And make sure I can do it as easily as possible. Like I said, this really isn't even that difficult, it's just... Yeah. Alright, so this part is going to be tedious here. Okay, so this part's pretty easy, so what you gotta do is just a pattern, so just know the pattern. Get down the right first. Don't fall off the slide, and you have to be there, and you have to be in the middle, then the left, then the right, then back to the then, then, then the left, then the middle, then the left, then the middle, then the middle, then the right. Easy. Easy peasy. It's a piece of cake. The hardest part about sliding down is trying to stay in the center. But that wasn't a big deal. We have 102 star bits now. 
So you go here, let's see what I want to I'm just curious. Yeah. Okay, the boss here really isn't even that difficult, like I said, but he's just kind of an annoying boss to fight. Wizard is one of my least favorite bosses to fight, but I mean, he's not that hard, but he ain't even that bad. It's just. It just kind of takes quite a bit of time. So we're going to get our power shroom. Here's Squizzard. So this boss right here, what you gotta do for this boss is, the reason why, I, there we go, that's what you, what you have to do with Squizzard is, you have to, you can get hit by him very easily. Um, I mean, it, it really isn't that difficult if you know what to do and not to do. Um, once you learn what to do and not to do, he does become a lot more manageable. I just don't like that his boss. See, he takes up a lot of time. You don't have a big window to hit his mouth. That's why I don't like fighting his boss as much. He is so annoying. Our Squizzard is rude at the most annoying. He's the single most frustrating boss in the game. I don't like him. Because I can never do perfect at this boss. He always wants to beat me. He always wants to try to beat me. And I'm not going to let him. Wow, that was easy. Wow. I've died on him several times just because of how annoying of a boss he is. Not because it's difficult. Um... There we go. Never will I have to worry about him. There we go. That's the boss of Slip Sand Galaxy. There's going to be a Daredevil comment at this boss. The boss really isn't even that difficult. It's just when I do the Daredevil comment, that's where it's going to get really difficult. And I'm not looking forward to doing that. That's it. So we're gonna do the second star here now since we have time. I didn't think Squeezer gonna be gone that quick, but just be patient with Squeezers. Patience is key. That's how you beat Squeezer. I was just the reason why I didn't beat him when I practiced him is because I was trying to find a risky way, like a way that would beat him quickly, um, and it did not work. I just prefer being patient. Okay, so now we're going to scale on the same DCs. This is a pretty easy star right here. This is a lot easier than the first star, actually, in my opinion. So we can get a lot of star bits here. So what we got to do is we got to do this. And we'll do this. Let's grab more star bits. Just for the heck of it.
There we go. Danger, don't fall in. You know what happens if you fall in the quicksand, just like in the first Galaxy game, it's the instant KO, just like in Mario Galaxy 1. Okay, so this is pretty easy right here, especially if you have a lot of star bits, if you have at least 37 or more star bits. Try to collect as many star bits as you see. Try to get rid of every Kamek you see, and just learn the pattern. It's very straightforward. This level is very basic. Stay here, Kamek. Do not see how annoying Kamek is. I told you, I didn't even get rid of him. He's that annoying. But we don't have to worry about him no more. Thank goodness. Okay, I don't know. This is a pretty easy level. You know what you're doing. A lot of the stars in this game are not even that difficult at all. A lot of the stars are pretty easy in this game, but I love them better. But they're not even that difficult. But a lot of the stars are pretty basic and straightforward. A lot of the stars in this game are pretty straightforward. Okay, so what I'm going to do is, um, this golden chomp does not need to be here. We're going to keep him away. Very, see, very easy mission, like I said. Easy peasy, like I said. Very, very easy. There we go. Very easy, like I said. Easy peasy, like I said, to that mission. That mission is a piece of cake. That's a 75th power star. Wow, Squizzard went quicker than I thought they would, but... Let's do the Prankster Star of Shiver Burn, because that star we can do real quick. And we have plenty of time for that. Octo Army Icy Rainbow Rock. This one should be pretty easy. I know this is a really easy start to get if you know what you're doing, but if you don't know what you're doing, it can be difficult, but hopefully it doesn't take too many tries. I know this is a really short mission. Get them all! I'm just going to be quiet here and concentrate. Shall we? Yes! That took two tries, but... Alright guys, that was it. Thank you very much for watching, guys. And have a good one. I'll see you guys next time.
Peace.